Anna Sorokin, who also uses the surname Delby, is set to star in her own unscripted reality TV series while on house arrest in New York City, E.T. has confirmed. The convicted fraudster's intimate, invitation-only dinner series, which are hosted at her East Village apartment, will be the focus of Delby's Dinner Club. The series from Butternut CEO Courtney White will see an assortment of actors, musicians, founders, socialites, journalists and other esteemed guests join Sorokin for candid conversations where no topic is off-limits, including Anna's experience within the criminal justice system, her strategy to rebuild her image and her plans for the future. There's nothing like the experience of bringing together a curated group of friends to share life stories and enjoy a great culinary experience, Sorokin said in a statement. I'm grateful for the opportunity to work with Wheelhouse and Butternut to bring my vision to a wider audience and share a glimpse of the real Anna Delby. White added, it's often said the best way to get to know someone is to share a meal with them. We're all desperate to know who Anna really is. Delby's Dinner Club will reveal the actual woman behind everything we've read and watched about Anna. She is breaking her story in her own words and we believe she will defy viewers' expectations. Wheelhouse Entertainment, which is the parent company of Butternut, also confirmed the news on Instagram. We are reinventing Anna with this new series on Manhattan's chicest scam artist, the media company posted. E.T. has learned that the Sorokin is hosting the first of her official dinner party series on Thursday in her East Village apartment. The dinner is considered a belated birthday celebration, as she celebrated her 32nd birthday on Jan. 23, with the get-together called, Anna Delby's Happy F. King Birthday Party. The invite-only party will feature a six-course dinner created by Chef Ryan Hackney of Citizens Culture, a restaurant in the Washington, D. C. area. Sorokin's guest list includes 16 people, including Julia Fox, who visited her during her house arrest. According to the source, Sorokin is expected to host several dinners over the next several months as part of the dinner series. The series comes as Sorokin, who was released from federal prison in October 2022, awaits a final decision on her immigration status. After serving out her sentence for theft and larceny charges, she was taken into custody by Immigration and Customs Enforcement ICE, for violating the terms of her visa. She was eventually released on a $10,000 bond and placed on strict house arrest, which requires an ankle monitor that confines her movements to her one-bedroom apartment and involves regular check-ins with her parole officer. When E.T. spoke with Sorokin in November, she opened up about her plans for the future, which included hosting an exclusive dinner party series. The events will be focused on social good, she shared at the time, revealing that she was in talks with multiple charities, mainly on criminal justice and immigration reform because this is where my expertise is, and I will invite some of the representatives from these organizations and hopefully this will help shed attention to this cause. While Inventing Anna chronicled the past few years of her life, including the crimes that made her a household name in New York City and a viral sensation across America, Sorokin also said she didn't have any intention of putting her own life in front of the camera, at least not the way it's been seen on screen in various documentaries or on Netflix. She also said she had no interest in doing reality TV, shutting down rumors of her starring in her own show. There's no truth to that, Sorokin shared at the time. However, one thing is for sure, Sorokin is determined to make a comeback, with her first post-prison venture involving making a splash in the art world. As E.T. previously reported, despite being stuck at home, she has been selling the drawings she created while she was incarcerated and even hosted a pop-up show last May. Titled Allegedly, the gallery included etched drawings reportedly starting at $10,000 apiece. Since then, a collection of originals have been available for purchase, with prices ranging from $17,000 to $25,000, while Sorokin says that other prints are also available for $250.
I've sold a lot of my prints and a lot of my art, Sorokin said, explaining that she's poking fun at myself and the events I've been through, through my sketches. She added, I just see it as one of the many tools I have to use to kind of tell my perspective and kind of like, tell my story and to kind of like, share more about myself with the world. Poland.